dashboards, track progress and share results that are personally tailored for your team. Dashboards are available on our enterprise plan. Right now, dashboards can only be created from the team, main account only and set to be accessible by all users invited to your own account. However, you can share it with selected team members. A range of filters is also provided that includes project groups, project, and custom fields for projects. This is added to save your time. When you will create dashboard widgets, the results will already be filtered by filters you set when creating your dashboard. Now you can add widgets. There are three types of widgets currently supported, charts, buttons, and tables. Filters in a widget are catered to the application you use in a widget. In this case, milestones attributes are available. We will select not completed milestones only. You have multiple ways to customize created widget. Switch to percentages, edit, copy a widget to quickly create a similar one or delete. You also have access to display a widget full screen that is great for your company's big screen projects dashboard. Downloads of data in multiple formats is also supported. To change chart type select, edit. We support bar, pie, battery, and summary types. Hover your mouse on charts with multiple areas to highlight it and see the details. Let's create another chart widget for tasks. Since we use custom statuses, we will group tasks by status type. Here is another example of a chart widget where the base is our projects and results are grouped by a project priority that we previously set as a custom field for our projects. Let's add the buttons widget. You can select buttons color, reorder buttons you already created with drag and drop, add, edit, and delete them. You can use any links here. Some free camp beta users of dashboards interconnected multiple dashboards, using the buttons widget as each dashboard in free camp has a unique link. You can also set if links should open in a new browser tab. With global dashboards setting available via the cogwheel icon, you can show or hide legend on charts. Download the entire dashboard as a PDF file or image. Options to copy a dashboard to save your time can also be found here. Let's add the table widget. Once a widget is created, you can resize it. Now you can further customize it by selecting table columns. You can resize columns. You can open an item's details by clicking on its title. You can edit attributes directly from the table's widget too if you have permission to do so. We also added the ability to create custom columns, but they are only supported for the table widget when the table basis is selected as projects. I created a custom column called milestones for milestones that are not completed. Now I will create another table widget. I will group my projects by a project group but our dashboard is set to use the marketing project group, so we will have only one section in our table widget. Once a widget is created, I can access my custom column and add it. It now represents a count of unfinished milestones in each project.
We also added here a button that will optimally fit your table into a designated section. The mouse click on the numbers in such custom columns will lead to the milestones board. In fact, all dashboard elements are made interactive to drill down to see the underlying data. Team members you shared a dashboard with and having no access to those data or have only partial access will only see what is allowed when they click. Please give it a try and give us your feedback. The enterprise trial is now open and not requires you to contact our support to enable it. As always, we do not make implicit conversions from trials, so you are in full control to let a trial expire or cancel it at any time and be back on your current plan.